He's running for his life as the earth shakes. He shelters in a doorway. Many people caught in yesterday's 6.4 magnitude earthquake in Southern California did the same. I told everybody, get back. Um, maybe stand in a doorway. I don't know. That's what I learned from school. But new research says they're wrong and that standing in a doorway during an earthquake isn't a good idea. So what should you do? Get on the ground. First, drop to the ground, as seen in this Inside Edition demonstration. Second, cover your head with one arm to protect from falling debris. Then, crawl under a table or desk. The Earthquake Country Alliance says hold on until the shaking stops. We're seeing more video today that captured the sheer terror of the earthquake. These children were performing a 4th of July show when it hit. Wait, earthquake. what's going on? And here's what happened as cameras rolled at KCBS in Los Angeles. Oh, shoot, it's shaking. It? Look. Yeah. Oh, shoot. Oh, Is this oh, it for him? oh, 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 oh. Look at Surveillance cameras captured the terrifying moments in stores, inside people's homes. Good Morning America's Eva Pilgrim experienced one of at least 159 aftershocks recorded after the earthquake and had to flee. Get out. Frightening moment right there. I was at the epicenter near the town of Trona, 170 miles from Los Angeles. This liquor store in Trona was hard hit by the quake. Virtually every shelf was affected. The owner tells me that between his two stores, he sustained about $100,000 in damage. He said, fortunately, no one was hurt, and all of this can be replaced. Now the whole region is bracing for the possibility of an even bigger quake to come. City University of New York professor Michio Kaku. Within a 30-year time frame, the probability is 99% that we're going to have a big one.